ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another video, and meanwhile, everyone's busy downstairs, it's like 1.32 a.m. right now, I'm pretty tired, but literally the second I start being tired, I'm about to yawn, oh. I'm not sure if I'm going to be very uh, expressive, so basically, today I wanted to talk about my New York theme park or amusement park experience. Um, I went to Seabreeze the other day. Um, and that's basically the last one on the list. That's really all I've got to think about in New York. So basically, there's Darien Lake, there's Seabreeze, and the much less appreciated one, which just happens to be my favorite, Roseland Water Park. Um, each one, they're good. Um, so, I wanted to talk about what I liked about each one of them. And if you're ever stopping by in New York, and I'm not talking about like the actual city in New York, I'm talking about like Western New York or all over, I want to tell you which amusement park you will want to go to to have a fun time. Um, well, Sea Breeze. Uh, the most advertised one out of them. Uh, it's in around a quite. It's fairly small, but I only went the other day. I had a blast. There was not a lot of people, but I'm sure a lot of people could be there. But who knows? Um, just depends on what day you're going to. Um, the water par park thing, I can't complain. Um, I find the schedule and stuff was a bit weird. Um, everything orbited around on a different schedule. If one ride wasn't open, the other one was, and all kinds of other things like that. Pop-up thingy. Stupid McAfee or McAfee. Um. Oh, yeah. Um. It, it was pretty cool. Um, relatively cheap good for the money I mean we got a deal it was like $13 for a ticket and uh, I went with my old friends and we had a blast it was pretty fun um, overall I will say this the lines aren't too bad rides were definitely fun just there's not a lot and if you're looking for fun it's there there's just not a lot next we're gonna move on to um, my personal favorite Roseland Water Park which is the best um, at least in my book because it's cheaper than the other two at least I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure um, it, now it's cheaper than the other two and I had a lot more fun there Basically, not a lot of people go there. Uh, it's over in Canandaigua. I have a cottage there every year on the lake. Mostly we're at the lake, but it's nice contrast going to, uh, going to the water park every now and then. And, uh, I can't complain. I love it. Um, there was a webcam issue earlier today, so I'm just trying to make sure that everything comes through because whatever um ah, I hope you didn't hear that but the mic is pretty quiet because of that um water slides oh yeah that's the one thing it's only a water park uh both other ones have water parks water park divisions but their sole focus is on the rides Versus Roseland doesn't have rides, but the water park par park thing is where it does great. I know for a fact it beats out the rest of them. It's got more uh, water slides than you could think of. Uh, best splash zone slash kid area ever. Even I had fun playing there. And, um, and I'm like 13, so that's the thing. And, uh... 
there's my favorite slide out of all of them. You're like 25 feet, if not higher. I, I don't know the actual measurements. Okay, I'll go with a good 50, 40 feet up in the air. I thought this one was called the Wooly Mammoth, but what it is, you go, you're going down, and all of a sudden you start going scoop. And uh, I thought it was called the Wooly Mammoth because, you know, Wooly Mammoth's tuck, tusk goes like whoop. Kind of like the Nike um, logo. But no. The loop, the actual Wooly Mammoth is actually like a big tube that were custom made for Rosalind. And what you do, everyone's spinning in this awesome water slide. And it looks like you're about to go over the top of the slide. It's pretty cool. Um, that's the one thing. Rosalind is great to go with, with a pretty good group. Not a too big group. But pretty moderate, like, um, like three to six people. I I had a blast with uh, with my two other friends. These weren't the same ones. Uh, this one was uh, two friends from grade school. But uh, it was when I was in middle school. So, yeah. Now we're in different schools. But we had a blast. It was pretty fun. Now the final one, and actually my least favorite. Darien Lake. I've gone there since I was little. Maybe that's why I don't enjoy it. But I have my reasons. And here's what it is. The place is trash. Ter <sighs> Terrible service. I'll go with that. It's not clean at all there. Most of the time, uh, there's trash all over the place. Um, the rides... They're fun. It's got a lot more rides than any of the other ones. And the water park is pretty good. I mean, I don't think it's the best compared to them. I think it's like maybe a little better than Seabreeze, but not much. And Darien Lake, um, they definitely excel in one thing, and that is... Uh, prices now normally it costs about $40 for a, a solid ticket however um, to get a season pass it's only 20 more dollars you could go as many times as you want during the summer for $60 I don't know about you but Oh, we got got to pay sixty dollars. It's only twenty more dollars than the actual tickets. Well, sign me and the rest of New York up. Come on, let's go. Uh, it's pretty cool. Um, being able to go that often, you will get bored, and that's kind of why I don't like it. Cause every year for like four years straight, we got all the passes. The place needs new rides. It's pretty boring. Nothing has happened there. Um, of course, I haven't gone there in like a year now, so I was just scared. This is getting to be a pretty long video, so I'm going to start ending here. Um, basically, out of the three, Roseland is my favorite. But, you know, you can choose. I think I didn't really give Darian Lake a chance here. Darian Lake has his pluses. You want rides? You want fun rides? Go to Darien Lake. You want a mo you want a moderate experience and pretty decent before before it gets late, at least in the morning or something. Go Sea Breeze. If you want something aquatic and something to do in a hot summer day, go to Roseland. It's all cool. Anyways. I'm not beard. Well, no, I'm not gonna end that quick. If you guys enjoyed this video, leave a like and comment below what you'd like me to do next time. And if you're interested in a guitar, Nerf, or anything else that I did, because I completely forgot my and 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 I can't think of it and thing routine, then uh, subscribe. It's free. Um. Anyways, I'm not beardly. This time. Peace out.
stupid yawn scene has me yawning. Like, this is too much.